Hello, this is Yellow Hobo, and we're playing Blacksmith Master. This game's out on demo right now, and in Steam Next Fest. It's a pretty game. I like the graphics on it. I played a little bit, just a smidgen. And we can go ahead and get into it. And you get your first person mode, you got your top down mode. Hit E to continue. Uh, e again, it's going to want you to go ahead and hit M and accept a quest. Yes quest uh, to actually do it so once two tomahawks it's going to let us learn carpentry after that and you can either hit m or the, hit the little escape button so you're going to hit c to craft tomahawk just to queue it up and it's down there in the bottom right actually bottom left then bottom right you grab one of these ingots right here and hit use and just put it in the row that one wasn't too hard. And then you're going to take it over to this anvil and hit E to start. And you got to hit it on these green spots. This game, uh, you get character or you get helpers pretty quick. So you don't have to do this always. But it benefits you to not miss like I just did. I'm not good at striking all the time. And then we got to go cool it off and then throw it into the uh, good old cart over here. There you go, We've got 45 coins. I'll do like the instant payback on there. Oh yeah, we gotta actually hit C again, oops. So we gotta hit C on that and then go ahead and do it again. So get it going and let's see if I don't mess this up again. Golly, that was rough. <laughs> All right, don't mess it up yellow. There you go. Perfect, and you get 50 coins, and you can see in the bottom left, it says bonus. That's how you know how much you're going to get in the first place. So, if you ever have a, ch a question about it, it's there. So, you got to go M, complete the quest. Thank you. Now, it's going to tell you, blah, 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 now you have carpentry. You can go ahead and go in here and go on tab, hit tab to go in manager mode, or the top-down mode. And you can get all your goodies from this little tab right here. And this is your carpentry table. And you can just place it down where you want. And you can move everything around as well. So Z and X is how you shift, which, I mean, it says on screen. But I'm going to go ahead and point it out for you. Tuck it away in that corner. Hit back. You're all prepared. Now, uh, I like hiring new workers and whatnot. One of these quests is not like the other. So we need these little scrolls to actually do this uh, red chest thing over here. Which that's an easy quest in the first place. Uh, yeah, and you'll have to get... So we need two of those little scrolls and we don't have a single one to our name right now. So we're going to go ahead and start this up. Knock this knife out real quick and get it done. Don't forget to queue it up like I do. The kitchen knife actually sells for quite a bit. Um, don't know why, but I'm not going to complain. There you go. Perfect. And use this. Don't mess it up. Boop, 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 boop. Ah. <sighs> Man. Well, yep, you know. Can't win them all, right? <laughs> so let's go ahead and get uh, our two scrolls, and you can hit E to do it again. Uh, I'm not gonna make you sit here and watch me do this the whole time, unless you, if you do want to do that, I could I could leave it in there for you. But you know, not too uh, much going on. So I'll see you once I get all these done. Also, you see how it says that I've already completed it. You can put a kitchen knife in here and just get paid for it still so you go to your map you know complete you know, do all that good stuff oh uh, it's a good amount of chunk of change I'll probably do that all right last quest and luckily we had that knife so we already got it done we're gonna go ahead and complete this up and then we need to get three cute cudgels done which Carbon tree is pretty straightforward. You just grab from this pile right here. Once you have it up, <laughs> you grab from this pile, walk it on over. And this is the only step as far as I know. And 
It's just an easy little mini game, you know? Don't miss it. It's a pretty big green square, so not too hard. Command, there you go. So we gotta do that two more times. So we got those done, now we can go to the map and claim. Now, let's see here, I'm gonna pick up a, a good paying quest at 70, it's 100. You know what, I'm gonna pick this one up. Start it up. And it might, you might wanna, come on now. All right, so we gotta buy a bench. And we gotta put this bench over here somewhere. I think in a corner would work. Uh, you know, actually, can I put it with some red? Can't buy a new prop because some props are overlapping. I uh, got you, got you. So you can't have it overlapping. That's fine. We'll just put it in the corner. I think that's, eh, let's move this over one more. That's okay. Yeah, it's got a pretty easy move and re redo the whole system. I like it at least. We're gonna put this over here and this right there. I feel like that's a good little setup. And this, like so. Yeah, so they ain't gonna walk very far. Now they would do walk pretty far from here to here, but I think that's gonna be okay. And now we gotta go to this little thing right here, the icon with the, uh, and it wants us to get two blacksmiths. Yes. So they have, you know, their skills and whatnot. And looks like this one's got some creativity and blacksmithing. No, no other goodies from that though, so that's okay. We're gonna go ahead and get you and Majory. There you go. And we need to hire at least one assistant. And let's see here. A little bit of speed and storage. Actually, this one's looking good and this one's looking good. So let's go ahead and hire you. There you go. Get off this and if you prefer to just manage a shop workshop without controlling anything, you just use a tab and open manager mode, which allows free camera movement and speeding up time. And you can sp sp speed up time right here, but it's almost, uh, well, Man, it's like 12 a.m. So, surprise is not making me end the day already. <laughs> so at the end of the day, right, um, it, it won't let me like go off tab and go grab this and finish it. Yeah, because the day's ended. So you can't just cheese it and let everybody, you know, have all of it done. If I was smart, I would have grabbed this from the chest and thrown it in the cart so I could turn it in. But, yeah. Never been that smart, you know? So we're going to go ahead and end the day with T. You got to hold T. And lost a little bit of money. Okay, you know, got to pay the wages. And I'll let him run that over. That's what the assistant does, is run it over. And the long run is you're actually going to open up this shop and sell out of your shop, too. So I think that's a pretty cool concept. So we're going to go ahead and complete that. We need to get, you know, allows blacksmiths to design new items for crafting. We need two for that. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and that's a pretty good one. Uh, get that started. And they, they should be able to work, you know, simultaneously now. One doing the carpentry, one doing the uh, actual metalworking. Which is pretty cool. I mean, look at that. Look at him. You get it done, boys. So did... We already got that done pretty quick. I don't know what they're making right now. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and start this. We need a lot of mugs. Um, it's going to take a little bit of time, but it'll be all right. Only bad thing is I can't accept multiple quests just yet. I don't know if I can ever. You have prestige, of course. And then uh, this is upgrade blueprints. You can earn them by blacksmith by assigning black, blacksmith to use design tables. We're about to get into that. Once we get this quest done, it, it'll be finished. And I think I might jump in line with them and actually do a tanker myself. Just so we can get this done a little quicker. Didn't take any time at all to do that. And we get that one done. 
you don't have to click the complete thing at all. And here's a little bit of uh, what's going on. Uh, you can pretty much make your own design, which I haven't really gotten into too much yet. So we're gonna go ahead and place this design table right here, nice and easy. Oh, might need to turn this around. But yeah, there's that. Uh, we got this quest done. Go ahead and get it turned in. Doing the easy quest right now. Can I do this one too? Nope. Okay. Not yet. So, mm, we can take it like a tankard and look at this. And it breaks down into iron ore and all that good stuff, but I don't have a way to do anything extra right now because I can't make any different ingots on it. So, kind of at a standstill for right now. Turn this quest in. There's a money. Oh, you can get a shop going. Uh, I think getting this might be better. Just, just throwing it out there. But we need three for that. And I might invest into a, another... Let's do this one. So I'm not tempted in to invest too heavily into another anvil. Or not an anvil, uh, another... Another uh, smelter and anvil. <laughs> Big money coming in there. Uh, we can get this now. That's, yeah, I'm definitely going to get uh, another. It'd be smart to get another uh, furnace up and running. Can I place it there? Yes, I can. And I also want another anvil, which is going to wipe us out a little bit on money, but that'll be fine. Maybe put it like so. Look at him getting it, getting it in, baby. Easy. And I do recommend you helping them with uh with the crafting, just so you can make a little extra money. Like I'm making a hundred bucks just by helping. There goes the last one right there. Boom. So we got... Allows you to smelt ores into ingots in, in, using a spelter. Which is uh, hard to say apparently. You can hire more skillful workers. That would be nice. Uh, let's see here. 210, 220. Let's go ahead and get that going. Easy money. Need two more of those scrolls right there. It's telling me I don't have any smelters for crafting ingots. Yep, I, I know. Uh, is that a problem? Because we still got plenty of ingots. I just wanted to get that out of the way, you know? I guess I'll get the shop upgrade next. Even though we slung some money around, we've made some pretty good progress. Eight scoops. Ooh, we. Actually, you know what? That's a lot of money. We need it. <laughs> I don't have an extra carpenter yet, but that'll be alright. Didn't even let me end the day. It ended it for me. So, you see, we made 190. That's that's not too bad on making money. Spent some money, but that's alright. Alright, get to work, boys. Got the eight scoops done. And that's a good amount of money. Uh, I guess we probably should get the shop so we can buy some racks. I already got the goblets made and I think we got one tankard made, so not gonna be too horrible. Like, yeah. Actually, we got the tankards made too. <laughs> All right. Help him run these over here. Get this turned in and boom. Get a shop unlocked. So you can buy racks, choose what is displayed on each rack, buy a checkout counter, hire a cashier. Okay. So, ore crate. It can be used to store ores anywhere in the shop. That'll be useful. Um, we kind of need to not do that. You know what? Go ahead and start on this. I'll start on this. 
can I? Are you, are you not doing it? Come on, boys. Oh, I guess we already... Do we already have this? <laughs> I guess we already have that done. Cool. So, I'm going to go ahead and go in here. We can hire... Oh, the blacksmith's already got a little. Okay, cool. Um, what is this? Determines the time it takes to process different ingot types. Determines the amount of design point acquired in a day. But you have zero design. You know what? Um, we're gonna make you like a little jack of all trades. Yeah. And I did want to look at this. Can I extend the floor? Possibly, because it's not gonna do it. I guess I could like scoot this over somewhere. Let's see real quick. Move this over this way. I guess I could put a shop counter in here. What is this? Storage. Okay. Huh. Racks? I don't have any prestige to get a rack. Or no, I guess it gives me... Okay, it gives me storage. Crate rack. Let's turn this around. Watch you. Weapon rack. Okay. Can it go anyway? Maybe. Huh. Why are these red? Don't understand why they're red, but okay. You can upgrade these? Ah. Alright, so we got all that done. I don't really need lights just yet. Oh, well, we can just put plants in here and get real prestigious real quick, huh? Uh, some checkout counters don't have cashiers. Yeah, we gotta, gotta fix that, huh? Hire cashier. Y'all have three, so I'm gonna go ahead and get one of you. So these can only have one per display. That's gonna, yeah, I'm definitely gonna need some extension around here somewhere. Can I, uh, can I do that? I just wanna see. Eh. Ah. Does it even cost anything? What about walls? 50. Okay. Can I remove wall and get paid for it? Maybe. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. All right, so we got like a little shop area going on. Looks pretty good. Pretty snazzy. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get this started. We need ten tomahawks and five tankards. Can be a little busy. Looks like we got our first customer. All right. Yeah, just walk through my shop. I might put a door over here just to keep them from coming in through like the workstation area. You know. He's buying a cu cudgel. 72 bucks? Oh no. Maybe he bought the cudgel? I don't know. I'm not for sure. Oh wow, he got another level, huh? Oh no, this is the other one. I want to get you into design. So whenever I get to it, you can do it. I'm not going to get this one done today, I don't think. Well, maybe. We got three hours. If I start helping. Alright, so we got this one done. These crates are used to store ore closer to mel smelters so assistants don't have to walk a long, pa long path to the warehouse to fetch ores. Okay. Click edit in an assistant info menu. Ah, okay. So I figured out that you can actually switch them over so like you can change it here and you can craft racks or design new items. So once I get a new person I think that we'll probably have them just doing that but I'm having one literally just fill racks and then one doing the quest items. So I mean right now it isn't a big deal to do that. Plus, it's end in time for the day, so it'll be alright. Not too bad. We didn't make as... Well, actually, we made a little bit more money. But we had a lot of purchases. A lot. 
start the new day and let them get at it. Now I think I might need to get another runner just to fill the racks. Because he's doing as best as he can, but I mean, it'd be nice to sell a little bit more. Yes, you, you gonna buy that? Let me go ahead and get this turned in. What, uh, 16? I don't even have enough wood for that. We'll, we'll get another worker. Yeah, and that's 1,090, so not horrible. So we're out of wood, and I don't know if I can order more. I guess I'll try. Info. 30 for 750, you know what? Get it. Worth, in my opinion. We're making pretty good money with the shop, too. Oh, did I get that? I don't even know how I got that. Right on the tail end. Dude, I don't know why I do that every time. Y'all make me nervous. I did fine with the other five. Ooh, my assistant finally got leveled up. So what does this do? Walking speed, number of items that can be carried in the bag. You know what? Do that. If you can carry more, I would be all for that. All right, so we get this one now, so we get more skillful people. Um, You can hire more skillful workers. Okay, I guess that was the one before. I don't know. Some items required for this request are not designed by blacksmiths. Ah, okay. Earn design points and unlock it in the blueprints. Well, sad day. Um, I don't know if that's actually worth it. I mean, I guess it is, but I guess it's not. Um, you know what? Start this. Uh, the other blacksmith that's been filling. Uh, actually, who is... The blacksmith, the blacksmith, you. Alright, so you're gonna go back to this and Godiva is gonna change to design. Alright. They are working on this as fast as they can, maybe. Alright, you're gonna go up another point in carpentry. Thank you. Just because we have so much going on right now. Dang! We made some money today! We made some money! Angry customers? Zero, okay. Get this next day going. So I need 25 of these knowledge points. I forget what they're freaking called. What are they called? Uh, blacksmith points design table points maybe so these points <laughs> okay gonna go ahead and order more wood might as well since we got the money turn that quest in for another 1100 I don't think I can do you yet because I need to get that butcher knife so go ahead and start this I moved the cash shop like this, so it makes a little more sense. So he's watching the store. I don't know. Also, let's see if I can add a door. <laughs> can we put a door? Will they be able to use said door? I'll put it right there. See what happens. Alright, so they still come through here, but they exit through this way. That makes sense. We almost got our last point. There you go. We're going to go ahead and pause it up and go to utensils. It just takes ingot, so unlock it. There you go. That way we can get that next quest done after this one. And I do need another bench in here, so might as well get that going. And can I hire, well, actually, you know what? I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna hold off on hiring another assistant because uh, we're gonna get more skillful people here pretty soon. Get this quest turned in right at freaking midnight, it seems like. Complete it, start this one for sure. And 
guess I can help out with this. We ain't gonna get it done today, but you know, get it started. Alright, start the new day. I was still crafting whenever that went off, so I couldn't pop back to it. We're gonna keep on getting these points just because we need them for a lot of things. I'm guessing that we probably need them for, uh, let's see, we need the ability to smelt. And I don't have that unlocked yet, so I wonder if it's in any of these tools? Hmm. Okay. I don't see it. Hmm. They got some cool looking stuff in here though. Finally finishing up the last one here. And boom. Got more skillful workers. What does this give me? Smelting tea allows you to smelt ingots into bigger ingots. I don't have smelting, I don't think, you know? <laughs> uh, we can get into that. That's a little bit of uh, some money. And you know what? I'm going to start this. And I'm going to look and see who I can hire. Blacksmiths. Wowza. Yeah, I think I'm just going to go ahead and hire you. You're pretty good at carpentry, but I already got a guy working on that, so... Don't really need another one just yet. Assistant. Whoa. Okay. This dude's got a lot of carrying capacity. You're fast. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna get you. Level six guy. Don't really need another cashier. I can look at him. Whoa. Okay. Cool. Gonna give you another level into carpentry looking pretty decent I mean either way I mean more skillful just means like you ain't gotta hire them and train them but I mean it's not too big of a deal here's the smelter I ain't got room we have money though so I think what we're gonna do here is add me some floors that's rugs, I don't need that. This floor. Good. Should be fairly sizable. And we need to get the walls just right. All right, got that in there. I don't really need much else right now. I guess I, I, I was in, under the assumption that I didn't have that, but I guess I do. And we can go ahead and, and yeah, iron ore. What, like, do we get it from somewhere? Because I got someone grabbing it. Ah, there it is. Is it like an endless supply or we pay for it? What? And the assistant, I guess, just straight up smelts it. Okay, cool. Godiva got another level up. I don't think I'm going to give you that. I think I'm going to start throwing this into here so it gets a little bit better on smithing. And tomorrow I think I might hire another blacksmith just to uh, ensure that we are doing the best we can. Oh, Francis? Getting there? Uh, I want to go ahead and turn your speed up a little bit. See what that looks like. I mean, you're a little quicker. You ain't like me running, though. Oh, we got it done. But at the end of the day, we got her done. Beautiful. So we got three quest points. We can do this. We need metal scoops. Can I just click on it from here? No, okay. Just thought I would try and see, but let's go ahead and go into blueprints and tools utensils metal scoop 25 okay we can get that and let's go ahead go to the map get this started I need 20 of those so good thing I'm getting another blacksmith and one more ingot thank you those don't take very long I need to get someone with a little bit higher uh, carrying capacity though so I might switch him for the other guy. 1500 that day, not bad. 
I'm gonna go ahead and get Grace. Uh, she's only level four. This dude's level five. I was gonna pick him up, but I just want to go straight into blacksmithing so it's faster or metalworking. Might need another bench down just for assistance. <laughs> So someone to carry him from over there, then bring it over. That way we're not spending a lot on this. We can have a total of 225. He brings four at a time, so that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and invest into a staff bench. Because we're going to need it eventually. Might as well get it going. Yeah. And they're cheap. Now the not so cheap thing is getting assistance so you can carry quite a bit i wonder if that helps you are fast hmm fast you know what i'm gonna go for you i might you know what? i might hire you too well they got this refresh button on there that's not bad not a bad one to have uh i think i'm gonna do you and this guy's gonna be just filling the shelves because that's money we're missing out on right now. Fill the racks. Oren, yeah. We got that order complete pretty quick. Smelting two, finally. And we can get into bigger and badder types of deals. That's gonna take way too long. We don't have, yeah, that, that'll work out better for me. Ah, oh, you just completed all the content in this demo. Thank you so much. Well great game i had fun took me an hour and 14 hour and 15 minutes so i wonder if i can keep on playing so hopefully i can yes i can still play i don't care if i completed all your content or not <laughs> yeah uh i'm looking forward to this game uh, that's gonna be it's gonna be fun we're keeping up with the ore baby all right, so it seems like things are winding down. I would want to move this for now, since it's kind of in the way. That'll work. And I want to get a second chest. Possibly. Where is it at? This one. Yeah. Give me another one. Like, I don't know, right around here would be fine-ish. Move this out of the way a little bit. Yeah. Then bring this back in the way. That way it flows just a little bit better. What's so special? Okay, it's just you. Hmm. Man, we're getting uh we're getting pretty feisty now. Look at that. Spending a lot of money. That's fine. Uh, I don't really mind that at all. We just gotta get it all together now, and we'll be fine. Got that job completed, turn that in. Uh, well, let's see here, 23, or we can do this one. I think I need another iron ingot pile. If I can put one down. Uh, just gotta find it maybe, decoration, staff, nope, that's not any of those. Cause we have this. Can I get another one of these? Just storage. Hmm. Cause I can change it to be ironing it too, but what happens to all the iron ingots that are in here? You know? That's the worrisome thing. So you can have copper, silver, or gold ore. really don't want to get rid of 66 of these, but I got two for science. Crop can't be changed because some orders that have been started depend on it. Okay. That makes sense. I think it might be time to get another uh, little setup in here with a furnace and a anvil. Oh, we got it complete. Money. I only got one more quest, and it's this one. Um, is the map any bigger? Can I move on it at all? No. Progress. So here's what's available in the full version. You get cooking, mine. Oh man, this is gonna be gonna be good. Gonna be good. 
Second floor, tanning. Hmm. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. Went ahead and bought another uh, carpenter workbench just because it'd be faster to have two making it than just one. Majory. Gonna go ahead and get them up to uh, level four carpentry. It's gonna be good. We almost got this done. Good thing I added that another another carpenter workbench. Actually, it's done. There it is. Complete. Oh, there's more quests. That's what I'm talking about. Man, we already made some pretty good progress for the map requests. We've made 4,000. Oh my gosh. Almost 5,000. Angry. No, nope, no angry customers. It's probably because we're in demo. Turned it off. Spent almost a grand to keep everybody fed for the day there. That's cool. New Godiva's up there now. Confirm it. Grace is up here too. Give you that that level three blacksmithing. All right, that that quest is done. All right, I guess we'll do these twenty six maybe. So pretty much we're capped out on everything we can do. Really, I can I can do a pitchfork. But I think it's been a good showcase for this game, and it's got a lot of promise. That's for sure. Yeah, carry three items. I can't wait until this is actually out. It's super promising. I hope you enjoyed watching, everybody. Don't forget to uh, check it out for yourself. It's on the Steam Fest right now. And I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day, and goodbye.